Hey guys, Nader here, and welcome to Insanity Gaming. We are going to be continuing Creeper World Anniversary Edition here today, and going right into it will be, uh, I'm going to try to come, since these levels are usually short, I'm going to go right into Fitch, and uh, we might get into Ryan today, depending on how long this level takes. I'm going to try to go as quick as I can, and maybe even get to the last one. I guess I'll leave this on for about five, uh, uh, three to five seconds. Um which are still giving us, I forgot these missions were, are so nice, they're still giving us stuff, we get a new tech tonight, uh, today too, it seems, I forgot they gave this, this early, <laughs> the techs get harder to come by as they go though, or as you go, they don't want to give you the really good techs until later, of course, you know, as, as gaming does, and I hope you guys enjoyed the, the previous video, um, I, I, like I said in the last video, I will do recording these several, uh, several videos at a time, so if you guys leave comments as to suggestions and stuff, I might not get to it until a couple of videos later, I forgot to mention that, because of the fact that, uh, that I record these a couple at a time, so it could take me a little bit longer to, and out of habit, I'm making a really... Uh, a much more expansive network than I should, probably should be doing on the second level. <laughs> but, uh, so comments, so you guys leave comments, quite instructive, cursives, and all that fun stuff. Anything you want in the comments, really. Uh, it'll, uh, uh, if it, as long as, you know, as long as it's constructive, it'll all help the channel in some way or another. Um, So they might not be get uh, got to until a bit, uh, a couple of videos later, and that that's part of the thing that I'm trying to. On um, quick note, it click, click Q uh, deactivates it, and then you can do it again to activate it. Um, but that's part of the reason I'm gonna try to upload multiple videos a day is because that'll make it so it's not seeming like I'm ignoring you guys or the, or the death is uh, ignoring you guys when he makes his videos um, and I was I uh, think I have better circumstances at the time being I think I have better circumstances for recording than he does I think he's gonna do more on the mobile platform uh, 5v5 arenas uh, I forget what the full title of it is I think is probably a game he's gonna be recording maybe even with me in it though I don't know that uh if I'll be talking in it, I, uh, that's yet to be decided in this stuff, but, um, I think that's more of the platform he's going with for now, just because, you know, circumstances and things like that, and for now, I can't do, like, high-quality games because of my circumstances. Future, guys, future. That'll do better. Alright, I think I got a good enough thing, even though my energy deficit's in a big hole right now. This level's really easy. It shouldn't take too long. Um, they give us nice little shields. I should be able to get the the two rifts, and I'll even make it so I get them all at once, because why not? I'm probably going to need two guns, I think, to... And I'll just go ahead and go around, too. Now, the creeper, I feel like it does come out faster later, even with less and not less emitters or the same amount of emitters but um I feel like it's just coming out a lot slower in the beginning which might be just because these are still tutorial levels so I'll try to push it back I shouldn't need more than two blasters I'm gonna build one and just to make sure but Shouldn't need more than two blasters to do this. Now, an important note, the guns will not refill while they're moving. If there's already packets out, they will still go to the guns, but they will not refill uh, while they're moving. Which it really is, is a make, or, make it or break it situation sometimes in levels 
none of these numbers are actually kind of tiny compared to later levels you'll see the energy depths and all that go up like crazy but this should end the this should be the end of level so I'll shoot I will have time for uh, for the next level for you guys And totems, in case you guys are curious, take 10 packets. I've counted it out in my free time. They take 10 packets to uh, charge. Later, these missions get much more extensive, much harder to put the push the creeper back, things like that. So, and, uh, obviously, since the game gets harder as it goes, naturally. Alright, Fitch is done. And this is a nice little chart to explain the last video. Got your energy collected, which is very well integrated into that nice energy used white line. Um, and you got your creeper coverage in blue, and then that, usually in most levels, not in this one, will usually be inverse with the creeper killed. I've, I've noticed. Not necessarily like inverse it, but. It, if you have uh, obviously you kill creeper the creeper coverage will go down but we just didn't really kill much creeper not enough to actually affect the coverage it had that's why but uh yeah that's that that's the lines explained if you're if you didn't see it in the, in the last video so now on to Orion and so this is gonna be a little bit more mountainous this region here and just so you guys know, these do have hotkeys. Uh, you can do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then on the twentieth level for story, you get zero here for that one. I'm pretty sure. I've never actually used it, but it, the tech, honestly, I don't, I don't like that tech. And if it didn't take so long, I'd try to beat the level without that tech because it's just they make it overpowered and make it so. Because level's hard and twenty's hard without it. But I think I've seen a video of it done without it, which if you guys so request, I will try to do it. Just know it'll take a lot longer to do. And when a creeper's moving slow like this, I don't mind running my energy consumption in the ground for a few turns. This tech right here is mortars, by the way. We get another weapon this round. I personally, I don't like mortars as much. I find that their cost is too much, and I'll, I'll show you guys when I get it how uh, how they look and how they act. Blasters cannot, and I might have explained it might have explained in the text if you guys read it. But blasters can't shoot an elevation higher than that uh, than theirs. But mortars don't care about elevation. They also have a wider range. I don't know about their health. I, mortars I wouldn't need as much health, you wouldn't think, so I, they might not have as much. But um, I don't honestly know about that. Another thing we'll unlock later are experience points. You get si uh, max six per level because there's six different upgrades. They add more later, of course. In later games, they'll add more uh, things you can buy, but right now in this game, they uh, have six. And this game is fully updated. They'll never update this as far as I know. And I don't even know the players are still making maps for this game. This game is a rather old game. But I figured this game's rather short as well. Two is actually shorter without some design made bonus missions. And I think it's just really uh, more of a gamble uh, on, Knuckle, on Knuckle Cracker's part. Which, by the way, Knuckle Cracker... Uh, if, if they happen to see this video, I do love all the Creeper games, even though I do, I don't like two as much. I do love all the Creeper games, so I want I want to make sure that is clear. Um, 
2 is just, I, I guess the only thing I didn't really like about 2 is just so much, it's so different from this. And you'll guys see, you'll guys, uh, you guys will get to see that later when I get to Creep World 2, which when I do beat story, I might, when I beat this story, I might start to story and then throw in a random video from Creep, Creep World 1, I might do it that way. Just let me know what you guys think of that idea. If I continue the story in Creep World 2 and just work on the bonus levels intermittently. Alright, so we can start on blasters. I'll build two blasters and we'll, uh, wrong button. There it is. We'll build two mortars. This won't be too hard either, though. There's only five emitters, which I know sounds like a lot, but they don't push out much creeper. The hardest part about it is this pool, and it's not going to be hard to clear. You can just cut it off. I don't know that I'll do it, but you can just... Actually, I will do it. I'm going to go, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to go down here and, uh, and cut it off, and then it doesn't matter what's in the pool and what's not really. Uh, if there's any in the pool it doesn't matter because I can connect to the pool uh, totems without actually needing to go inside the pool. And then I'll cut it off up here and get to this and I should be able to before the map ends or before it get or not before map ends, before it gets covered, be able to get to this. Maybe with just one blaster there to keep it company. I'll demonstrate the mortars on here for you guys. I got a few seconds until this builds up anyway. Actually, I'll put that there and I'll build uh, another blaster. But, like I was saying about mortars, I think they're too expensive to be worth their cost. <clears throat> well, blasters can shoot an elevation lower than themselves, so that doesn't matter. As you're seeing. Ex ex or example A. So here is a mortar, which it might shoot this way. I'm not sure. It, it'll do whatever it decides to do. But, but I'll put a couple over here because they're about to get energy production. Good thing is not much energy is being used, but these things take time to build. I forgot to put that there. Probably should have that there. And blaster's coming up. I'll put him right here. Little note, if you move that, wall packets are still coming to it. If the connection happens to break, because obviously it connects to the other parts of the thing while it's, or the grid while it's moving. If a packet's coming along the line, and say it was a packet was coming along here, and it started to, or it got about right here, and, and it broke, the connection broke, the packet disappears. But yeah, as you can see, it doesn't really have a care about elevation which I don't know why it's focusing. Yeah, there it goes. <clears throat> Doesn't care about elevation, really. That's a lot of packets right there. And all in all, I should, note, I should put a little note, which I'm not going to use these, but I just want to show you guys what they do. Um, a little note about this. Creeper has elevation levels. It does not technically have density in this game. Um, I guess in a sense it does, but it technically doesn't have density because it just it goes by elevation, how high the creeper is. And you can get a sense like, oh, that's density, how high the creeper is, but I don't consider it really density. I consider them to have more of a technicality than, a, oh, that's density, you know. <clears throat> Since it goes completely by height. I'm going to buff up my thing, which we're not going to get to the last tutorial uh, mission in this video. I'm going to try to do my best to keep these videos under 15 minutes because that's kind of a I mean, I'm not gonna be one of those. We're not gonna be one of those YouTubers that are gonna pad to make a, some sort of 10-minute benchmark that I'm not sure is true or not. 
knows um if it's true or not I, I'm sure it's some sore beef to, or not beef but truth to that but you know who knows Sorry about the agonizing slow movement. I can't do that. It's or can't do any better. It's gonna go whatever speed it goes. You know. I'll make a, another one right here just to make sure. <clears throat> I think the last video was last video I did was 17 minutes, and I'll be honest, I'm recording them on the same day. Um, record probably this one and the next one right out the gate. Maybe even one more, depending. Um, but yeah, this game, and honestly, my recording software is not being too easy in my frame rates right now, I'm sure. I don't have it up, but I don't think it's being too easy in my frame rates. This computer, kind of old, I'm sorry. I'm, gonna, I'm actually upgrading at some point. Sooner rather than later, hopefully I'm gonna I'm gonna save for an upgrade. So then you guys will get better videos. Now there are upgrades later. You can get speed packets. Uh, I have, that comes actually that being the next. Uh, like you got your weapons and then you got your like infrastructure type of things which I'll show you guys what this does this is your energy I forgot to explain this is your energy uh, how much energy you can hold on hand <clears throat> and this wall this is not a packet to, or a thing to upgrade it Which you'll see when that completes and turns on. This will be at 40, and it because it, it upgrades 20 at a time. I like to keep my energy on on a map that's going to take any form of time. I like to keep my energy on about um, 100. 100 is what I usually keep it at. There we go. This will end the map right here, and I'll get you all guys off. Uh, or get this game get this game off or our level completed, that's where I'm trying to look for. Level completed. <clears throat> past this video, I think the other one's longer, past this video, after you uh after you complete the last tutorial mission, I think I guess they're technically tutorials. After you complete that la that last uh set they do get longer so we'll go to that one a video and I'm gonna try to keep them below 15 minutes like I said but I'm gonna at most I'd like to, uh, at most I'll go for 20 which I do believe we're hitting very shortly And if you guys are interested in this game, this game is five dollars off of Knuckle Crackers website. Really cheap game. Two is also five dollars, and then three is fifteen. And they do have another game called Particle Fleet, which I, my computer, honestly, my computer barely runs it as is. So I will be, uh, I will be uh, recording it when I get a computer upgrade. I will record it. But I, I won't be able to run it. I should also note, send, uh, put a little note here. Once these launch this, the game level's over. I think your mission time, yeah, your mission time just stops and your mission scores what it is. So once that once that launches, the level's over. But uh, that that is a this is another installment to our lovely Creeper World series. One of the favorite my favorite games for what I'm playing right now. Um, 
I get a computer upgrade, I've got some games on Steam. This game, uh, Creep World 3 and Particle Fleet, and Particle Fleet has DLC as well that I did buy. Um, I've got the entire thing. There's a deal. Particle Fleet's $15, the DLC is 3 or 4 and then where you can get the, there's a bundle for all of it, for, I think 35 is what I bought. So you can get this game relatively, these games relatively cheap and they would put such such great effort into these games I know that I remember reading in some of the extras you get in the particle fleet they put a lot of effort and really appreciate the support so if you guys find this game interesting definitely I would say it's definitely worth the five dollars for this game and two's worth the five dollars and three is worth the 15 for sure Parkle fleet is as well and the DLC was definitely worth it too um, it doesn't, I don't, I haven't seen where it affects the story. I know I'm rambling, but I, I, I've seen where, I haven't seen where it actually affects the story, but it does add some extras for you. But, I will end the video here today, guys, and if you, uh, if you enjoyed the video, I would appreciate a like. If you enjoyed, uh, the video enough that you want to see more, I would appreciate a subscribe. If you dislike the video, uh, I forgot to mention this last video, if you dislike the video, hit a dislike. Um, and, and I would appreciate some feedback and uh, in the comments below. Uh, with that being said, guys, I'm, I'm going to head off. Have a good day.